stuff like that of uh, of logging and stuff. You got Bobby Goodson, uh, Thomas Johnson, and top, uh, top top three and stuff like that. But the one video that you that you can hardly ever find it is a uh, mechanical sight prep. And for most people that don't know what mechanical sight prep is, is being it's commonly in the southern United States uh, as far as beef shear goes, but in, in North Carolina, mainly North Carolina, South Carolina, and uh, um, you, get, you get the bed part of it, which is actually what I'm doing today. Uh, A lot of people actually don't know about this, um, except being loggers and stuff like that. But they, you know, nobody hardly ever mentions it. But it's a, it's a pretty, it's pretty fun. Um, you, know, you get to drive giant bulldozers in the woods, you know. But no, uh, mechanical side press. Well, you can Google mechanical side press, and it will, it will. Uh, pull up a whole list of stuff. I mean, mainly as you pull it up, it shows up foreign, foreign equipment, uh, like forders and stuff like that. But, uh, no, down here in North Carolina, I work for a company called Woodland Vegetation Management. We're based out of Farmville, North Carolina. Uh, we have six tractors in all that do this. We got three B85s, uh, P8s, I believe. We got one old, one of the 85s is an older tractor, and we got two death machines. That's my boss likes to call them. They, they're good tractors, but when it comes to fixing them, man, they, they get them up there in a the dollar. I tell you what. And then we got 365, which is the one I'm having to run right now, and they're all Komatsu's. Uh, this is a Komatsu P65 PX. Um, mainly we use it for bed, but it's a uh, pretty good shear in the wet stuff. I mean, as you can see, I mean, we this, this is a wet block. I'm actually on a, on a block right now in a Hosky, North Carolina. Oh, my 
vloggers, a lot of videos I've watched on YouTube and stuff, they say, you know, all you do is sitting in a, a piece of equipment all day, got air conditioning, AC. I tell you what, you got that part right, but what they don't get right is the damn boats you got to go over. But I tell you what, it don't matter. You gonna feel it. This dozer, this dozer, if you hit a stump just right, boy, it feels like you can go and hit a, hit a wall running 60 mile an hour. I tell you what. And, uh,
listen, man. I'll tell you what, so much, so much can happen in a quick second, man. Tear up a lot more than you fix real quick. That's what any job does, but this one right here, you've got to constantly stay, stay focused and looking at what you're doing. One minute you can be going along, the next minute you're going to bust the window and don't go there and get a log or a stick up. And it's, uh, it's a mess. I've done it more than once. Bottom 
the back of that wheel banger because it locked the roller up. And I had to take the chainsaw and cut it out. But I'm gonna hop out and get this here stick. And uh, we're gonna let it work. But uh